Hello there and welcome to PGA Tour 2K21. My name is John and my job is to get you swinging that club like a pro in as little time as possible. Let's crack into it. To begin your swing, push and hold the left mouse button and pull back. When your golfer reaches the top of their backswing, push the mouse forward to swing. Make sure you keep holding that mouse button throughout the swing. That's what we're looking for. After each shot, you will get feedback as to how accurate your shot was in the bottom right-hand corner. In the middle of that circle, there's a white stripe, and that is your swing plane, and that is where your swing needs to live. The more difficult the shot, the more narrow your swing plane will be, so pay attention out there. Now let's try another swing and keep it inside that white stripe. Good job, that's what we're looking for. And you're also gonna receive feedback on your swing timing, and that's the meter that kind of wraps around the top of your swing accuracy indicator. Your backswing timing refers to the point at which you transition from backswing into downswing. If you do this too early, you're gonna reduce the power of your shot. If you do it too late, you're gonna add power, but increase the difficulty of the swing. Your downswing timing refers to how fast you push that mouse forward. If your downswing is too fast, you'll hook it. And if that's the stuff. Congratulations, you've got the basics down pat. Can't wait to see you use some of these lessons out on the course. In this lesson, we're gonna talk about one of the most important skills you can have at your disposal, and that is putting. Okay, to begin your putt, hold that left mouse button and pull the mouse back. The farther you pull back, the stronger your putt will be. Now the backswing meter at the bottom of your screen is gonna indicate the proper strength for this putt. When the indicator gets to the, well, you've got that one down. The putt weight is how hard you hit your putt. To set your putt weight, move the aim marker towards or away from you. The further away from you the marker is, the stronger your putt will be. Since this is a downhill putt, we'll want to ease up on our weight. So move your aim marker a little closer to you by using the down arrow or the A key. And then, well done on that lesson. Those moving dots on the grid are telling us that your putt is going to break to the right, so you're going to have to aim to the left to compensate. To move your aim marker, you're going to want to use the WASD keys. Well, you've got the hang of this one. And with that, you are ready to tear it up out there on the greens, metaphorically speaking, obviously, as hello and welcome to this lesson where we will talk about clubs and shot types. I am gonna show you how to make the most of what's in your golf bag with a few simple tricks. 